you called, we came, in ships bigger than anything we had seen, dwarfing our islands, covering them in the shadows of smoke and noise. Crowded, excited voices filled the air, traveling to the motherland, we're going to England. Over weeks, over oceans that threatened to engulf us, driven by a wish, a call to save, to rebuild and support efforts to establish health for all in the aftermath of war. You called and we came. Women and men of positions and qualifications in our homelands. Nurses with a pride in the excellence of our care with experience in teaching, management, organization, and a sense of duty, we appeared, smiling and eager to work on the wards, the schools, communities, and clinics of this England, our motherland. You called, and we came. Our big hearts, skillful hands, and quick minds, encased in skins, of a darker hue, which had shimmered and glowed in sunnier climes, but now signified our own difference. Matrons became assistants, nurses became chambermaids, all the while striving to fulfill our promise to succor, to serve, to care. The blue of the sisters' uniforms seemed as far away from us as the moon, unreachable by our dark hands in this cold land. But we were made of sterner stuff. The hot sun, which once had beat down on our ancestors when they too left their lands, shone within us forging our hearts and minds with the resistance of ebony. You called and we came, rising like the phoenix from the heat of rejection. We cared, we worked, we studied, and we organized until the quickness of our brains and the excellence of our care made it very hard for you to contain us. And slowly, so, so slowly, the blue uniforms that had light bodies now had dark and lighter bodies beneath them. The professional care in our touch was valued, despite the strangeness of our speech, the kinks in our hair. You called, and we came. A new millennium, new hopes spread across this land new populations engaging and reflecting the varied, diverse, and vibrant natures, nature of these shores, challenging and reflecting on leadership for health, moves to melt the snow at the peaks of our profession, recognizing the richness of our kaleidoscope nation, where compassion, courage, and diversity are reflected in our presence and our contribution, not only the hopes and dreams of our ancestors. Human values truly needed to lead a change and add value. Remember, remember, you called, we came. <laughs>